Hey people of the internet, Alex here. I have another Elix video today. This video is a tutorial on how to get unlimited skill points and stat points in Elix. Uh, this is a great trick to couple with the unlimited Elixit video that I made before, uh, the tutorial on that. So basically if you combine this plus that trick, you can overpower your character and just get as many stats and skill points as you want. Uh, I'll try to make this short so I'll jump right into it and uh, tell you what we need. First thing we're going to need is to be in Origin, which is the town in the center of the map. Uh, you don't have to be here, but it just makes it a lot easier because everything is at this place. You don't have to go anywhere else, so you can just do it a lot faster. And then you also need a point in the chemistry uh, skill, which is in your crafting abilities. So with those two uh, things, what you're going to do first is you're going to go to the trader here in Origin. And he has an item called Natural Elix. You probably found it in the world. It's, you know, a common item. And you're just going to buy as much of this as you can afford. Uh, if you keep going back to him, it'll keep replenishing itself. So you don't have to worry about running out. It'll, it'll, it's basically unlimited. Um, after you buy the Natural Elix, you're going to go to your crafting tables over here. And you will have to have a couple recipes uh, that you can find in the world to buy from vendors. I'll put those in the description of the video where to get them. You'll need the small elix drink, elix drink, and strong elix drink. Uh, what all these do are, it's basically in the description to the side as you can see. The small one is experience, the medium one is attribute points, and then the strong is skill points. So th this is built into the game. This isn't you know cheating or anything. You're just be, you're just gonna be able to get a lot more of them because of the Alexit glitch with Trader and Origin. But yeah, you, you basically make whatever drink you want, and they piggyback on each other. So if you make a small drink. Then you want to make a medium drink, obviously you use small drinks to do that. And then you just, you know, go up the chain. And then whatever you, whatever you're aiming for, whether stat points, attribute points, just dump all those drinks and then and then drink them from your inventory. And there you go, you got uh, free stat points and skill points. So for myself, um, I just did it so that I could, I just, as you can see, my stats aren't overpowered or anything. They're still just, you know, within the 50s, most of them. I just did it to use a, a sword so that I could kill enemies a little bit easier because I was running into some issues around level 17 with questing. Well, I just felt like I couldn't get anywhere, so it helped me out, but I didn't want to like totally break the game and you know, get to the point where nothing could hurt me. Uh, but yeah, it's it, like I said, it's built into the game. It's there for you to use, so definitely if you're having issues, uh, this is a great way to just level the playing field a little bit. Um, if I missed anything or you know something I don't know, please comment below. I actually found this from another user who commented on my previous video, so I appreciate that a lot. I love finding new things about this game and then sharing them with everybody so it can make it a little bit more enjoyable. Thank you for everyone who watches, and I will have another video ready for you guys soon. Also, let me know how the sound is. Uh, for some reason, to me, the voice seems muffled. I don't know what's going on with my mic, so if you have any suggestions on how to fix that or a good sound setup, please comment and let me know. I would appreciate it. Thanks, everyone. Bye.